let's talk about how wealthy Bill Gates is for a little while because I've become, I've become obsessed with this man. It's just, I used to think Donald Trump was the richest man in America and it's, he's not even close to the richest man in America. Bill Gates is the richest man in America and it's a blowout. He, he is worth $59 billion. $59 billion. He makes everybody in here look destitute. And I know, even if you're like, no, I'm, it's okay, I'm a billionaire. No, fuck you, you are broke <laughs> compared to Bill Gates. He, we have nothing in common with him. He has nothing in common with your, your run-of-the-mill garden variety, single-digit billionaires. <laughs> like, most of your billionaires, let's be honest, are, have one billion dollars. <laughs> They're what I like to call barely billionaires. <laughs> Whenever I'm introduced to a billionaire as a billionaire, and it turns out they've only got one billion dollars, I always say under my breath, barely. <laughs> And most of, the, most of the people who are given credit for billionaires are technical billionaires. They're rounded billionaires. They're worth like 978 million, 988 million. They're just rounded up to be billionaires. And they know they're failures. <laughs> they'll, they'll correct you. They know. I really thought Donald Trump was the richest billionaire. No. He doesn't have $59 billion. And neither will you. Unless, this is what you would have to do, other than working really hard and inventing something that takes over the world. <laughs> the other way to do it is, of course, to win the lottery. You would have to win a $100 million Mega Millions jackpot every week for 600 consecutive weeks. <laughs> but I'm going to warn you, that type of streak, very rare. Almost unheard of. It's very... <laughs> but that's what that man is worth. $59 billion. And, and Donald Trump, on the other hand, he's worth, this is great, $2.9 billion. <laughs> 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 oh, what a loser. <laughs> what a loser. $2.9 billion. That's less than five. You round down less than five. Essentially, he's worth, in my calculations, he's worth zero billion dollars. He's worth zero billion dollars. And yet he's, you're, you're fired, you're fired. You're broke. Shame on you. You should be embarrassed. Walking around humiliated all the time because you can't tell me he's not competitive. He's gotta be. He's, these people have to be maniacally, mentally ill competitive. They have to be in order for me to cope with their success. They have to be. Other, otherwise, then they're, if they're regular people, then it's gonna kill me. That'll, that, that will destroy me. I have to be convinced that they're mentally ill. But I think Donald Trump, there's no question, this man is maniacally competitive and it kills him that Bill Gates is beating him 59 to three. It kills him. It kills him that he's losing by eight touchdowns. 59 to 3, Bill Gates. He can, he can condescend to Donald Trump. That's, that's got to be the best part of being Bill Gates, is talking down to Donald Trump. <laughs> Sees him at a party, goes up to him. Hey, what's up, Trump? <laughs> Just looks at him with that disdain that nobody else really can. What's up, Trump? You sickened me. <laughs> You're so tacky. You're so gauche. I made $59 billion. <laughs> and I call my business Microsoft. I don't call it Gatesware. <laughs> you egomaniac. You put your, put your name on everything. Trump on everything. It's not underwear. You're not going off to summer camp. Stop it. <laughs> Put him in his place. What's up, tr what's up, Trump? 
Calling somebody by their last name after a certain age, it's humiliating. <laughs> What's up, Trump? I heard you're up to $59 billion. Oh no, that's me. <laughs> but I'm sure you knew that. Nah, I'm just kidding with you. Listen, Trump. $2.9 billion is a good start. Seriously. <laughs> Seriously. It's almost three. And I'm gonna tell you something. I think it's adorable. I think it's so quaint that you still keep track of the points. 2.9, hmm. That's a, and listen, I'm sure it's a lot of money to you, $100 million, it's a great deal of money to you. I mean, to me, it's my fast cash setting at the ATM, but for you, it's, it's my walk around money, but for you, it's a significant chunk of change. Good for you, hang in there, man, keep swinging. You never know what's gonna happen. Seriously, some of my best times were when I only had a couple of billion dollars. There was, a, there, there was something about that fear, that doubt, that not knowing where my next half a billion dollars was coming from that, that just made me feel so alive. Netflix I love, but only instant. I don't really want the discs in the envelope anymore. I don't, I don't wanna, you know what I mean. I don't wanna go all the way to the mailbox open up an envelope, take a, take a disc out of the sleeve, open up my DVD player, put the disc in there, change the source 